Hello friends, this is a day in my life as I work from home. This particular morning, I ended up waking up at 7am. The first thing I did was to make my bed. I then brushed my teeth, washed my face and had to sit at my desk to learn German for 15 minutes. My friend told me recently that if you want to start a habit, do it the first thing in the morning and that's exactly what I've been trying to do. I want to make learning German a habit so I can open my German notebook to start taking notes. I listened to an audiobook on script which covers the German grammar this particular day. After 15 minutes, I wear my sports shoes and head out for a run. With gyms being closed this week due to safe distancing, my exercise was limited to a 10 minute run and some basic stretches outside. I listened to the audiobook, The Year of Less, which made exercising more pleasant. I do miss the gym, but Singapore's landscape does offer great locations outdoors to exercise, especially in such times, so I'm definitely really grateful for that. After a short workout, I head back home for a quick shower. After my shower, I sit at my desk for a 5 minute journal session. Since I ran out of oat milk and couldn't make some coffee, I ended up making myself some tea and have breakfast while binging on The Circle on Netflix. I might have finished an entire episode during this meal. I also used this time to scroll through my phone and catch up myself on what's happening around the world. It's quite scary to say the least. And now it's 9.20am and it's time for me to get ready for work. I use my favourite green duster to wipe down my monitor and keyboard which somehow tend to accumulate a significant amount of dust in just a day. I also make sure that my desk is clean and I'm ready for a day of work. I do use Notion for planning my personal life but I have not found the perfect application to plan my work tasks yet. So in the time being, I scribble down my tasks for the day on a random notepad. My task for today will basically to address some PR comments, investigate why the feature I released yesterday was somehow not functional in production, and write documentations as this was my second last week at this company. I spend most of the first 30 minutes planning my day, and if I'm on duty to monitor systems that week, then I also go through a thorough check across our SQS queues, any critical error logs we have, or any crashing ports. My teammates and I rotate this duty every week, and this particular week I was not on that duty. At 10am, my team and I have our daily stand-up meetings where we let each other know what we were up to the day before. This particular day, we also had a longer meeting to plan the tasks for the week on Jira and discuss any existing tickets we had. I then spend the rest of the morning addressing PR comments. For lunch, my mother happened to be working from home, so she cooked some amazing lunch which I had while binging another episode of The Circle. I didn't take a shot of me eating, so here's me drinking water. Once lunch was over, I then head back to my desk and continue trying to complete the task I had. I then had to review a pretty long PR, so I took my laptop to a table outside and decided to review it in an isolated environment where I'm not distracted by the big screen. At 4pm, I take a self-proclaimed 5 minute break and make myself some matcha latte with coconut milk. This is so good and really necessary to help me with my next task which was to debug a functionality that wasn't working for some reason. Nearing the end of the day, I had a call with my engineering manager just discussing my progress and other questions or feedback I had. These calls usually occur on a bi-weekly basis and I do find them really useful. The call ends around 6.30 and for another 30 to 45 minutes, I end up racking my brain with the task I had been debugging. I couldn't figure it out, so I ended up calling it a day. I then head to the supermarket near my house in an attempt to find some almond milk. 
Nope. Nope. Yes. Finally found it. I also packed myself some dinner and head back home. At home, I watched, you guessed it, The Circle, while munching on my dinner. After that, I had some food coma and spent a good 20 minutes scrolling my phone. Since I was on my phone already, I also ended up doing my brain training exercise, so technically something good came out of this. I use Luminosity quite often, and the games are actually really fun, and to be honest, quite addicting. I somehow managed to stop myself and go back to completing the rest of my tasks. I spent 15 minutes collating the metadata for my Solve for Happy video. This included adding timestamps, uploading the video on YouTube, and scheduling it. I also ended up editing my video for the next week. Time flies really fast during editing because I had no idea when it became 11pm. I didn't manage to finish everything I had, but I guess that's okay. Feeling relatively satisfied with my productivity throughout the day, I then get my clothes and head for a shower before sleeping. I aim to sleep by 11.30, which seems nearly impossible considering I sit on my bed for at least half an hour each night. By 11.45, I start to feel sleepy and put my phone away. Good night! Wait! Thank you for watching and see you in the next one!